Last two weeks, we talked about male breast cancer, we talked about gynecomastia, and this week, we're going to talk about nostalgia. It's not nostalgia, it's nostalgia related to breast pain. Breast pain in men is not really that common, and most of the time, it's nothing to do with the breast at all. However, it is a good idea to get it checked out. One of the commonest reasons why people get breast pain actually is the actual muscle itself. The pex muscle or pectoris major and minor is actually the chest uh, uh, muscles that actually sometimes can get stretched. For somebody who doesn't usually go to the gym or started doing heavy lifting and then that muscle itself can be quite painful. And the simple examination is just press on the muscle and it is painful. And a simple non-steroidal anti-inflammatory will usually do the trick. Sometimes trauma itself that actually will cause fat necrosis, meaning that the fat cells that is padding around the chest actually get injured and get damaged. Treatment itself, nothing at all because majority of the fat necrosis will actually get absorbed. Other medical conditions such as the breast lump, for example, cyst in the breast might even cause breast pain and another condition called fibroadenoma. These conditions are not so common in men, however, uh, however in women it's very common. So a simple ultrasound scan on the breast tissues itself, even in men, can identify a cyst or fibroadenoma. Sometimes a very enlarged male boobs or man boobs, gynecomastia itself can cause heaviness around the chest. And more commonly, another condition such as the um, in medical conditions such as the treatment of medication, the side effects of anti-androgens or hormonal imbalance itself may cause that chest discomfort, might need some attention. More importantly, go and see doctors because occasionally breast cancer itself will cause a typical tethering of the skin, pain of the chest lump itself and also palpable heart lump. It will need attention because remember, 1% of breast cancer can happen to men. So for next week, we're going to talk about another interesting facts about male breasts or even female breasts we're going to talk about extra nipples. If you're wondering you have an extra nipples, is it even possible? Is it a medical condition actually describing this? And why does it happen? What can be done about it? Stay tuned for next week's Putting Dr. G on the Spot.